We're gonna check up on you, see if you're right now. Okay. Alright, Charlotte, it's time to pack. We're leaving Malapasqua. Today's walk is gonna backtrack a couple of days ago where we headed our way out of Malapascua over to Maya Port to Boko City and down south to Cebu where we're gonna check up on Jake because well we're following up on his virus. Alright, we're leaving beautiful hippocampus and devotion. I think it's a yearly thing we're going to Malapascua. One of the world's most unique islands. Actually the only island in the world as you guys know with the pressures oh it's bright that's our boat are you ready jack 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 up here nope nope up 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 here up here yeah good boy up up boy. nice one <laughs> up 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 there you go good boy we're doing a private boat pickup from the resort it's about 30 bucks or 1500 pesos very nice Gorgeous. Definitely a paradise. Look at all these birds. And we made it back to mainland Cebu, Maya port quite new. Alright, let's get the uh, car, we'll grab a motorbike and uh, offload and back to Cebu City. Finally, we're here, Jake. Let's go inside. Hello. Thank God we got a car now. Look at all the luggage. Okay, perfect. Let's go. We're back in Cebu City. We're gonna do a couple of errands. Uh, gotta buy two drone batteries. We gotta take Jake to the vet. And then we're driving to mobile. We'll be there probably late night. When it comes to music, I'm very old fashioned. We're listening to this traditional uh, Maori culture song from New Zealand. I'm a huge fan of history and culture in the Pacific, including the uh, Philippines, of course. I just love the uh, Pacific Islanders and uh, the culture that it is here. Anyways, uh, we made it to Times Square. There is, uh, yeah, see that? Times Square. So no need to go to USA, guys. You got it right here in Talamban, Cebu, Philippines. <laughs> it's right there, Times Square. Talamban, see? Times Square. Okay. We made it through the Cebu traffic and done all the errands. We bought two batteries from my drone, which was 17 thousand pesos for two batteries in my drone. It's almost 400 bucks. Went to a dive shop, had some food. I went to another mall for Sherlin and now we're at the animal hospital for Jake to uh, check up on him. He got tested by, for the uh, virus the other day. I forgot the name, I'll put it down there. It's because of the ticks. So uh, if you have a dog at the Philippines, make sure he gets like this called uh, medicine called Nexgard. Next card is gonna protect your dog from the ticks. You lost weight, Jake. What's your diet? Okay, Jake. We're gonna check up on you. See if you're right now. These damn ticks, guys. Gotta be careful. And also be careful with mosquito too. That's where you're gonna get the heartworm. Ah, mosquito does the heartworm. Okay. Very good, Jake. Oh my good boy. Me, I'm not like that. <laughs> Jake was so amazing, Pepe. Good boy, Jake. Good, good boy. boy, good boy, Jake. You get some bone after that, huh? <laughs> You're such a good boy. The later, you can have a bone. You want some bone? You want some bone? <laughs> Welcome back home. Super. Wait, I'm gonna go into the <laughs> 7 p.m. Woke up 5 a.m. It's been a long day. It's been a long day. 
Time to shower. See you in the morning. Okay, we're about to go check out. Oh, hey there. <laughs> Anipa hut that we've been uh, building by local guys here. Supporting them, of course. Uh, it's gonna be installed over there. I think it's gonna be a, like a small area that Sherlyn is doing some uh, crafting, some artwork stuff. Oh crap! Look at this guy. That's gonna be rain. So beautiful here, and then. Oh boy, we didn't pick the good time. <laughs> we'll see. But uh, also on the way out there, we got a salmon road now. <laughs> so it's nice to drive into. Our place. Let's go. Look at this, guys. This cement road is complete. Done. Wow. We got cement. We got cement road, guys. Woo. This is so dumb. Where are we gonna stop? Somewhere over the rainbow. It's just going past by. You see that? It's thing? not. Sure. Look at this. It is passing by. Yes, we stop at a Nico's place, wait at the rain, now we go there. Oh! Rain night? Where are you doing, Finn? Are you gonna go to see her? No, shower. Oh. Taboo? Taboo, Tabu. yeah. Bananas. Quick snack. And rain should be clearing up very soon. Literally, you just came here in Nico's place just to eat that. Hey. You're in a Filipino house, so they <laughs> offer food. What can you say? There's always food in the Philippines. Of course. There's always that's why, that's food. Why you're, staying, you're staying here in the Philippines because there's always food. You never get, <laughs> you never get hungry here. Look at that, guys. Yeah. Wow. Two things you always learn in the Philippines. There's always noise, <laughs> constructions, and always plenty of food. This one is amazing because it has these uh, snails and shells in it. <laughs> but with the snail, you kind of have to get a stick and drag it out to suck it. You have to get something that's small and sharp. That out. It's really tasty. Mm. What can you say? That's the one? Yep. Nice. So they will put the the roof in there because it's really difficult to put it now. Cool, bamboo. Local mate. Alright, so when is it gonna be finished? Tonight? No, they're gonna send it now after this. Okay. Alright, here's the crazy thing. They're gonna put the whole house, I think, on top of that vehicle. I wanna see that. So this house onto that car. <laughs> okay, they removed the roof. How much food are we gonna eat today? There's food everywhere. So, how much food are we gonna eat today? I don't know. <laughs> it's so good. What is that? Empanada. Empanada? Try it. What's inside? Is that, I see an egg. It's a egg. Egg. Egg, carrots, potato. Ah. Vegetables. It's really good. Mm. Thank you. This is actually a quite common sight here in the Philippines. So you can just stand on the road, middle of nowhere. And this lovely lady over there in the red, she just came up with this bag of uh, tray or uh, some deep fried veggies and egg. It was delicious. So even if you're hungry looking for food, no, you never know what the locals might have. But now we're gonna wait for the truck to come back and then we're gonna load the house onto it. I'm gonna see if I can help them. <laughs> so Christmas came early for Sherlyn. This is my Christmas gift to her. A small working house for artwork and crafts. Hope you enjoy it. 
Thank you so much. And I'm gonna carry it now to the car. Hey, good luck, boy. Hello, hello, you. It's really heavy. <laughs> oh my god, how are we gonna do that? There we go. The whole car is pretty much set. The back of it, dismantled. Let's do it. Do you need me in there? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Difficult part. This one here. Just remove the bolts now, and then I think one of them is probably gonna be up there to keep it balanced while they drove very, drive very slowly back to our place. Now we're gonna load up to the truck, some extra bamboos to finish up some of the. Uh, patches for the walls and then we're off here they come <laughs> extra careful here this one nice one There's always a way in the Philippines, always. Oh, 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 oh,
And then they're gonna come back and finish it up, put up some walls and then need a roof. And now it's done. Hello. How do you like it? I love it so much. It's so cute. Show them your artwork. Come here. That is crazy. Look at that, guys. It's so detailed. Yes. Especially this one, too. Wow. Waves coming in. Even the foam is so... It's so real, guys. Look at this. So real. <laughs> By the way, it's only a $300, guys. The whole thing. Building, transport, and everything. Yep. Locally made. Bamboos from Southern Cebu. Mm -hmm. Alright, see you in the next walk. Thank you. Peace. Ciao.